Even with all the flooding and the damage that we've seen the past couple of days, there's always a good story that usually does come out of these moments. That's right. In today's Positively Carolina story, News 13's Taylor Maresca spoke with a Myrtle Beach couple who went out of their way to rescue several people from floodwaters during Hurricane Ian. Good morning, Taylor. Good morning, Melissa and Aaron. Jason and April Sizemore live in an apartment right on the ocean. When they saw the flooding on Ocean Boulevard below them, they knew what they had to do. Not just any vehicle can traverse Hurricane Ian's flood water, but this one can. Yep, that's yeah, his, a, his big truck's right over there. <laughs> truck, so. Yep, so we were able to get there. So we'll Take advantage of the situation when you got the equipment to do it. Old Faithful is what they call the 1998 GMC Sierra. It was able to get through water like this and save people. Why not you know, be a good bystander and help people in need? Yeah, we, we just felt like, you know, we were saved, so, you know, God just kind of said, go help these other people. But even with their lifted truck, the conditions were still rough. I could feel my truck slide just a little bit, and I was like, man, it's getting to the point it's getting a little dangerous. But I kind of went around the water as much as I possibly could instead of just going through it. But I was more like, no, there's somebody that needs help. Let's go this way. <laughs> He's like, we can't drown ourselves, so we won't be able to help anybody. <laughs> But saving people made it all worth it. The first one we saw was an older lady, and she was in a first floor apartment, and her um, she couldn't walk, and she was um, like trapped basically because it was knee deep water. So I kept her calm and everything, and she just really had an impact on me. And for the former firefighter and nurse, helping people is just in their blood. It's just in us to, if we see people that need help, we just go and do it. We don't think about our safety. I know we should, but we just want to get people help. So yeah. it makes us feel good. The Sizemores went on to help people on Saturday and Sunday along Ocean Boulevard and all the way to Merle's Inlet. They told me they didn't do it for any publicity. They said if they could help just one person, they would have done their job. Back to you.